information from the SMS gateway integrated back into Adobe Campaign. Um, so this is performed by a, a few technical workflows, which handle uh, some key integrations back to Adobe. One is the concept of updating the broad log table. So when messages are sent from Adobe Campaign, they are tracked into a broad log table, which basically determines, you know, who was sent what at what moment in time. Um, but that needs to be updated with a status. Did the message actually get there? So things like email, you have undelivered and delivered in various states like that. It's very similar in that SMS world where we need to determine, and this is provided by the Twilio's, the AWS, our messaging providers, did the message actually get what we expected to? So we provide a feedback loop, update Adobe campaign, the broad log table with the yes, no uh, delivery status uh, at a configurable time frame. Another integration we provide is the inbound message table. So in a custom uh, inbound schema table, we provide details of all the messages sent uh, that started from the SMS or that started from a user and were sent into the SMS gateway. So this is all the inbound messages. So anytime a user says yes or no or help or welcome, all of these messages are sent back, including the ones that were errors. So you can track to see one, maybe if there's new keywords or expectations, is there any confusion, but also to see how kind of how people are integrating with this tree and what they're doing, how that conversation is progressing. And again, this is a custom workflow that could be modify to run it more frequent or less frequent as it fits. We also track the outbound status, which is sort of here's all the messages that have been sent from the gateway to a user. So all those linked replies, any messages we've been asked to send, that's that the, the details of those messages are captured and stored in Adobe campaign. Again, at a configurable interval, kind of give you a complete picture of what those conversations are. And finally, we also integrate back all the blacklisting details. Uh, so the details of people who've asked to be stopped or removed from a tree. Um, one, we capture that in the gateway and we perform blacklisting there. But additionally, we integrate that back to Adobe Campaign so you're aware of it. Uh, you can take action there. Um, I've been asked in the past, is this configurable? Does it have to work with Adobe's core tables or can it use something custom? And it can be modified to work with custom tables that are custom setups of blacklisting that don't follow Adobe's core uh, configuration, i.e. a custom database table or custom field that is outside the, the norm. We can work with that. For more information, visit us at munvo.com or email us at info at munvo.com.